Hey everyone, uh, Alon here. Uh, I just wanted to uh, walk everyone through how to start collecting fees on their crypto exchanges. So this tutorial basically uh, assumes that you've already downloaded and installed the crypto exchange plugin and that you have MetaMask and know how to use that. Um, if you haven't already installed the plugin, uh, I have a separate tutorial for that. Um, but this is for advanced users only and people who want to uh, charge a fee. Um, all right, so if you've already got the plugin, you uh, have installed it, you could go to the crypto exchange menu. Um, right now, the only advanced feature is the custom contract address, but there is going to be more soon. But uh, so if this looks different in future versions, just remember right now you're trying to uh, basically change the custom contract address or add a custom contract address right here. Um, <laughs> there's some tests I did. Um, so uh, we're going to get started here with total. So total is uh, is what powers the, the WordPress plugin. Um, I use their API and copy paste widget to make it happen. So I wanted to show you this so that you could come here and if you want to go into the code and start customizing things and breaking things and playing with it, that's where you would go. Um, and uh, and so, you know, check, check out total.com for that. Um, and if you ever want to click on swap now or swap at the best price, you can actually see how their routing engine kind of works in a visual way so that you can see how cool it is and how you're getting all of your users the best prices across all exchanges. So Total is awesome. Check out the information about them on their site. Um, but where we're going to go today is the Total Console. Now, the Total Console is where you will actually deploy your own contract. Here we go. Um, so we're going into here. Uh, it'll load all of the contracts that this wallet has created, but for now, we just want to create a new contract. We're going to create a contract called um, uh, WordPress. Awesome. Um, and the payout address would be any Ethereum uh, wallet you want. Um, so probably just use the one you just connected with, or if you have a certain one, you put it in there. Now you'll have the option to come and collect fees as you go, um, but you get to choose your own fees here. So you can you know, put in anything you want, um, but what I would do is you know, choose something that makes sense and, uh, and total matches it. So this is kind of the standard of what most charge, but it's up to you, charge whatever you want. It's your uh, customers, your people. Now you deploy the contract, and once that contract is deployed, you will be able to take the contract address from that contract and put it into the site. And from that point on, all of the orders made through your site will be routed through this contract. Here we go. The contract has been created. Now it's showing all of the contracts under this address, but I'll go to the one. See, I'm seeing on my mobile alerts that uh, my transaction has gone through, uh, creating the contract. Now, this one was called WordPress Awesome. As it's loading, um, it's taking stuff from the Ethereum network, so it's being a little bit slow, which is normal if you're used to dealing with crypto. Um, now, uh, here is the contract. It will load. There we go. And you can see the amount of fee we're charging. And you can come here and see all of the transactions. So from this point on, remember that you can come here um, and, uh, and check on your transactions and see how much in fees you've collected. For now, I'm going to go back to our tab that has uh, our WordPress cryptocurrency exchange. I'm going to paste in this new custom contract. I'm going to save it. And once that reloads, I will delete the cache and I will make sure that everything works. You can now go to the site, go to one of your, uh, go to where you've implemented the widget and run a test uh, swap, make the swap, and we will then go to the total partner console and check that you receive the fees on that swap. All right, the transaction was submitted. 
waiting for the swap to be mined. And once that happens, like I said, we'll go to the total partner console and check. All right, that was fast. Um, I was gonna pause the screen to make it happen. So done, transaction has gone through. So let's go to the total partner console and we will refresh the total partner console now and see that this transaction has gone through. Sometimes this takes a moment because it's pinging the uh, network. But um, once that happens, what you'll also see, aside from seeing your transaction here, you'll see the amount of fees that your contract has collected. And you'll have the ability in the future, whenever you feel like enough fees have been accrued, to claim those fees. So uh, you'll see that in just a moment. Like I said, this, this kind of takes a second. Boom, there it is. You can see that uh, the transaction has gone through. It was a successful transaction. And you'll see down below here, uh, my face is blocking a little bit, but um, <laughs> uh, it, it says Ethereum, uh, and then how much has been claimed, and this is how much ETH you've, you've received in fees through this contract. So, so that's it. Um, uh, very simple. Um, you now are collecting fees on your WordPress cryptocurrency exchange. All right. Hey, uh, little, little thing here. If you do this or when you do this, hit me up on Twitter, send me an email. I want to see, I want to see this stuff. All right. looks like, uh, Ami from Onera is calling me. So I got to go.